All right, uh, we're on to lots uh, 10 and 11. These would be 31 litters. Uh, 31 litters sired by Good Company. Good Company is the Sloan and Hildy boar there that uh, uh, we've used uh, as heavy as any boar in this particular season, and uh, darn sure glad we did. Uh, hogs have uh, uh, been well received, and I think the feeding kind uh, on some of the older ones we're seeing looks like they're feeding extremely, extremely well. Uh, mother would be an in-game lock it up, would be a, Rod a Rodenbeck gilt there that uh, uh, Brantley showed a couple years ago there in the winter circuit in Ohio and had great success with. Uh, done a good job, makes consistent good feeding kind of a litters and uh, grandmother would be a lock it up Wintech sow that Swaim showed there uh, a few years ago there at uh, at uh, Expo and all summer and had a great career with her so got a lot of power in that particular sow pedigree you put on good company add some more uh, just uh, a sow power from a different way I think uh, everything matches here I think a pair of bear is very similar in their type and kind 31 2 is where we're going to start 31 2 has got an awesome paint job in terms of uh, his coloration uh, a hog that's going to stand out in those regards but uh, in terms of frame and length and everything matching. I think this hog does do that. He's stout about his head. He, he's stout coming and going. Leaves you with the heaviness of structure and a square kind of a hind leg. Uh, one that uh, balances up good on the side but still has shape and muscularity. Looks like an easy feeding kind of a pig and you can put him where you want to put him in terms of showing him anywhere from that late January to March setting. I think a hog that's going to feed tremendously good. Kind of look like that his whole life, the way that pig's going to look. And after feeding a few out of this sow, I think he's going to be stout, burly, wide and still have some of those extras in terms of uh, uh, width and power and inner dimension and still a neat kind of a look on the side. 31-3 uh, 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 is going to be the uh, uh, the litter mate bear here and one that's uh, the longer belted kind of a hog. One that does offer maybe a little more uh, a uniqueness in terms of look on the side. Uh, offers maybe a, a shot more in terms of uh, uh, length of face. Uh, big forearm kind of a hog. Extremely, extremely flexible out of his hip and hind leg and in terms of squareness out of his hind leg is, is one that's going to be to his advantage over quite a few of them. But uh, one I think you can push to heavier weights maybe than his litter mate. Uh, but uh, same kind of shape, muscularity, and stoutness on the top side of his skeleton. Pastern sets good. Uh, square coming, square leaving with a good kind of a look. And uh, I think a very, very good feeding uh, pair of barras, uh, with a high kind of a ceiling to have some of those extras when it's said and done. 